forgot my tripod at home. Hopefully uh, me holding my phone works good enough for you guys. Got myself some 90 degree adapters that I'm hoping to use on the Steam Deck. Uh, I don't want to break the only USB port that's on that, which is not convenient at all. Um, so I seen that these do 40 gigabytes a second or whatever they claim. But hopefully they uh, can at least fast charge. Now I don't have my tripod, so it's going to be an awful video. But I'm going to do a test to see if it at least fast charges. I got my phone right here that's fast charging right now. And then the phone I'm using, I'm going to switch to it because it's super fast charges. But this one don't. But uh, we'll plug it in through this 90 degree and see if it works. There is the beautiful box that they come in. Oh, it's magnetized to the... Sorry, guys, you ain't even seeing it. It's magnetized to the lid. Kind of nice. It feels like an Altoids kind of setup. You get them breath mints back in the day. I think you can still get them. Well, that's how they should have looked, but instead they fell right out. Nice little can tin that they come in. Nice little hinge on the back. Ooh, I really need my tripod. Well, it fell right out when I opened it. Nice 90 degrees. So one side is magnetic. This side is magnetic. And the other side, you just plug your normal, your normal USB in. So this will always go, this is really light too. It just goes over to the side onto your cord that's plugged in. And this is plugged into your device at all times. It says it has a 40 pins on it or something. Hopefully they don't get any rust on them and arc because I have had magnet. Here's my normal magnetic cord. I have had it arc and ruin a headset that I had. Have two of them, one test one. Let's go ahead and see if it at least fast charges. I gotta put you guys down for a second. How's the ground look? Does it look good? I'm gonna go ahead and put that USB C in to the bottom of that device, which it looks tacky as fuck on that device. Oh, it didn't go in all the way. Or I didn't go in all the way. Oh, man, that's a nice solid push. Now, if I had a case on this, it'd look normal. Again, this isn't what I'm using it for, but for the first time try, I am not plugging it into a device that's expensive as the Steam Deck. Uh, going to go ahead and plug that into there. Couldn't do that on camera because I don't have my tripod. But this should just creep along. Hey, look. It says fast charging. Isn't that nice? Let's turn it upside down. Turn it upside down and see if it goes both ways. Fast charging again. I think that chick's hot, so she's my background. Now let's see if I like twist it. Is it gonna come out? Is it gonna quit charging as I maneuver it around and all about? No, it stays in there pretty well. It still says it's charging. Oh gosh, it takes a lot to get that off there. Looks like it has a status light. I don't status light. I don't know if that changes. To you guys, it's blue for some reason. It's not blue. It's uh, it's white, gray maybe. And then when it's not charging at all, it's not even on. So that's pretty nice. Now we'll try it on this device, which handles super fast charging, I guess. Okay, you guys are on a totally different phone. Hopefully it's coming in good. Um, I went ahead and did some testing just to make sure this ain't a flop video. But put the adapter into a phone that supports super fast charging, which is a higher charging than, faster charging than what the Steam Deck even supports. So if you try to super, char super fast charge, whatever, super, what is it, super fast charge your Steam Deck, it actually lowers it down to the 45 watts, which this can go clear up to 65 watt, I guess. I, I don't even know the specs anymore. To me, they almost charge the same fast charging and super fast charging. But, uh, I, of course, you go with the one that's fastest if you're wanting your phone charged up in a quick manner. So I went ahead and plugged that in to that 90 degree. It has the extra buttons. Says so super fast charging. 
and then it goes away because it's charging it. Let's make sure it does it if it's upside down. Comes up with the same color on the bottom. Super fast charging right there, if you guys can see that. So that's great. That's great, great. So let's see if this 90 degree. No, no, don't, don't, don't do that. This 90 degree works. And sorry, I do not have a tripod. You guys just have to be banged around on this video. Super fast charging. I, you heard it. Oh, you almost got to see it. Just trust me. I said super fast charging. Let's go the other way with it. It said it. Will it show it? Super fast charging. Cool. Okay. So I'm sure it'll super fast charge the whole time. I really don't have to sit here and show you guys. So, this is also supposed to be a data cable. So, I got a stick that just has some GTA files on it for me doing story mode on the Steam Deck. I try to make content out of that. You know how hard it is with a video game that quite isn't rated for all audiences. Okay, I'm gonna plug this into the bottom. Whoa, guess it did itself. Right, right away it comes up, says USB connected. That's my beautiful girlfriend. And look, we can open it. Let's see if I can read what's on it. GTA Story Mode. They're all there. Cool. Huh. Look, trim Trevor's balls. There we go. Let's see if he'll play something off of there. Which I would... Sweet. It's pulling it right off that. I don't want to pull that and corrupt the file. But I do need to see if the other one works. Unmount. I call that the flip flash drive. It's a pretty cool flash drive. You guys should check it out in my video. It's USB C. And then when you flip it, it's USB A. And it's metal. It does get a bit hot and transfers only at like 100. But um, it's still pretty nice. I think it's like one terabyte. They make smaller ones, but. Okay, push that in. Has a really nice firm click to it. Let's see if this one works. Popped right up. I'm gonna pull that off to show you guys that it's. Yes, yes, yes. I know you don't like that. You gotta unmount it. Okay. So as I plug this in, plug it in right now. Pops right up. GTA story mode. And there's all my stuff again with that 90 degrees. We'll click on this one, a different one this time. We can't play video. It has been moved. The more you play it, bash his head into the wall. Feels like I just played this one. And there you go. So I assume it will do everything everybody wants it to do, especially charging the Steam Deck, which a lot of people are buying this kind of stuff right now for the Steam Deck. I'll just clip right on there. I just unmounted it. Why did I do that? Quick charge, fast charge, super fast charge, and it will do data. If it did this, most likely it's going to work plugging into a computer. There we go. Thanks for watching.